Hey, it's 11.20 right now. The military of... Uh, the Ministry of Railways wishes to thank all passengers for their patronage. This special express line is bound for Brayhard. Our next stop is Brayhard, the terminus of this express line. Please ensure you have all of your belongings with you when disembarking the train. Finally, we have to change trains here, right? That's right, a train bound for Lagram should be arriving in about 10 minutes. We'll need to hurry if we want to board it in time. Too bad. I was kind of hoping for a chance to poke around Brayhard. Oh yeah, this is your first time in Brayhard, isn't it? Brayhard, Brayhard, Brayhard. I'd be glad to show you around, should the opportunity arise. You didn't... You did graciously open your home to us in Nord, after all. Wondering what that sound was with the train. Okay. Okay. That took a while for us to get out of there. Jeez. What, do we just walk into this train? Are we, okay, well, yeah, we just walk into the train. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The way they were talking made it sound like we had to do multiple transfers, but it was only one. 11.30. Oh, it's almost 11.30 now. It's like 11.29. So close. Wow. This forest is really dense. Is it? No, it is not. Maybe I'm just used to actual dense force. It's almost like, looks like a scene from a picture book, as though if you kept it very quiet, fairies might come out to play. Okay. It might not come as a surprise that there are many such legends in this region. The Lance Maiden, Leanne Sandlot, was born in Lagram. But because of her her pre preternatural preternatural strength and beauty. I mean supernatural? I think that's supposed to be supernatural. They're missing the Sue. Some believe her a challenge um, changeling switched at birth by the fairies. Really? Fascinating. The reality is a bit less rosy. The family line of Count Sandlot came to an end when she died under mysterious circumstances. After the War of the Lions, it's hardly a surprise that such tales have persevered. Or persisted. A changeling, huh? Oh. Are you predicting the future? Oh, thick bog. That's what they were noticing. Um, again, maybe I'm just used to the thick fog, but that is not thick fog as well. Came on so suddenly. Well, Legram is well known for its fog, among other things. This is not at all uncommon for this time of the year. Fog does help keep the temperature cooler during the summer, though. In that case, bring on the fog. 
No, Lamb, you can't smash that. <laughs> You're lucky the Lamb just doesn't come out every time you say his name. Yeah, that's a that's foggy, but not thick fog. Really thick fog, you can't really see in front of you. Whoa. Like, the fact that we can see the Graham Castle means it's not that thick. It's stunning. It's the first time I've visited the Graham, but it's very- every bit as beautiful as I've led to believe. So this is the town of mist and ancient legends. <clears throat> I'm pleased to see that you have taken a liking to it. Unfortunately, the mist does uh, hinder the visibility. On a clear day, the surface of the lake gleams like a polished mirror. Father and oh, it's breathtaking all the same. Welcome home, my lady. Huh? How long have you been there? Interesting. I couldn't sense him at all. I have returned, Klaus. Butler name. Nice. I see that your proficiency in the art of concealment has not diminished in my time away from home. Oh, on the contrary. My age has begun to get the better of me, I'm afraid. Watching you grow and mature is the only joy left in an old man like me. Ouch, that's not... That's kind of depressing. Surely you jest. Can I assume that father is not coming to meet us? But I assume that father not coming to meet us means he's currently away from Lagram. I'm afraid so. He also mentioned that he was unsure when he might return. I didn't expect that might I did expect that might be the case. Nonetheless, allow me to instruct or uh, introduce you, everyone. This is Klaus, the Arsed family so steward. He filled in for, he fills in for my father in his absence and serves as an acting master for the Arsed School of Swordsmanship. The acting master? Sounds like one amazing old dude. Huh. You do look old. I trust you all have a pleasant trip, ladies and gentlemen of Class 7. I would be the first to welcome you to Legram. If you'll come with me, I'll escort you to the mansion. I can't really do much in old man voice. That's not a mansion. Still, it doesn't look like the years have really changed too much here. It's like walking into a bygone era. You can really see the influence of an Atomism in this region. Too, just look at the stone monument. I believe that was built long before the Arsid family was entrusted with the governance of this region, which would make it several hundred years old, at the very least. Hmm. It has a rather strange shape, too. Oh, oh what's that? A statue? I believe you have eyes. Here's the statue of the Lance Maiden. That's right, the center statue is the Lance Maiden herself, while those beside her are the two of the Einsreich. I believe these were made over 200 years ago as well. Indeed, traditions hold that they were constructed to honor the achievements of Saint Sanlot. Incidentally, the knights kneeling to the lower right is the Viscount that is the answer, sister of the voice count. So that's Laura's great 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 grandfather, huh? <laughs> You'll need a, a few more greats. We're about 10 generations apart. Later, Laura. 
Hey Laura, I'm so pleased to see you back in the ground. Viscount did mention that you'd be returning. I'm so happy to see you again, Lady Lura. I'm so glad to see you all are well. I'm just back for two or three days on the field, on a field study as part of my coursework at the Academy. I'll be sure to visit more with each of you later. Oh, of course, please do. I'd love to hear all about how life at the Academy has been treating you. She seems to be quite popular around here. Yeah. It looks like the Vice Count's family has built up a good re relationship with the people of Graham. Yeah, the opposite of you. Bracer's Guild. Looks like they finally showed up. Well, it's been pretty busy around here lately. I could use the help. Cat. Huh? Oh well, guess I'll go look over their tasks one more time, just to be sure. Really medieval vibe here. Jeez, is a war going on? That doesn't sound like a training studio, that sounds like an entire war is going on. I can hear the ring of steel on steel. Undoubtedly the sword the sound of a sword is crossing. So that's more than just sword crossing. So then this must be the our said school's training hall. Indeed it is. I have more memories in this building than I could possibly count. Although many of them involve being soundly defeated by my father or Klaus. I apologies, my lady. Well, it's pretty apparent he's not your run-of-the-mill butler. You can tell by the way he carries himself. He has a master's pose. Always nice, I'd say. And this is Vice Counter Said's mansion. Wow, so this is where Laura lives. You'd expect nothing less from a Vice Count. And it seems to be built on a hill overlooking the town, too. <laughs> It was originally built with the intent that it would function as a stronghold, should the need arise. Welcome to the home of Vice Counter Said. Allow me to show you around in my father's stead. Wow, what an incredible view. It's so beautiful. Not often I take in a view this spectacular. Yeah, great. Rocks and mountains and water. Say, is that? Wow, a castle. Oh, that must be Legram's famous landmark. Indeed, that's Legram Castle. During the War of the Lions, it served as the Lance Maiden's stronghold. It's definitely the, aside from the Imperial Palace, definitely the, probably the biggest building that we've seen. Saint's Castle towering on the shore of a shimmering lake. Just seeing it there in all its majesty makes me want to set brush and canvas. It does seem like a scene Taylor made for painting. I agree, but there will be plenty of time to take a, in the scenery later. Or now we need to go pick up our list of field study tasks. Jeez, those things just came into being. Alright, are you the one who prepared the task for us, Klaus? Actually, the signing of your duties has been entrusted to a professional. A professional? Ah, what? Can you elaborate? Head of the Bracer Gear Guild in Town Central Plaza. 
At the master's behest, they've taken on the responsibility of preparing all the tasks for your field study here. The Bracers Guild? That's a branch here in the Graham. There's a branch here in the Graham? Indeed. There's been a small branch of the guild in this town for many years. My family has a good relationship with the guild. They've done much for us and the town over the years. Oh, really? Well, whatever. Not like they asked me to do anything. What are you babbling on about? Nothing much, just thinking out loud. Anyway, it looks like we need to pay a visit to the guild. Yeah, I'd like to get through as many tasks today. As many of today's tasks as we can. You mean all the tasks? We'll be taking our leave now, Klaus. Of course. Please take care, everyone. Alrighty then. We'll be right. Laura running around. Would be a nice place to live. I do like the fog. This reminds me a lot of my hometown. Not like the night aspect or the castle over the lake. But just the the misty area, the trees, the greenery, all that stuff. It's nice. Keeps the temperature regulated. You don't have to worry about get things getting super cold or super hot. Funny they had the exact number of beds needed for us. Nice little room here. A painting. I'm guessing this must be the town. Kind of not as green as you'd expect. Mirror that doesn't work. Nice. What's the dude's room like? Exactly the same? Yes, just mirrored. Hello. I'm so pleased to see that Lady Lura has finally returned home. We'll only be in the gram a couple of days, but thank you for your care, Rana. I do hope you and your friends find some time during your visit to relax. I have every intention of serving you all the best of my abilities. Okay, so before we do everything... What's in here? Huh? Those swords are a bit big to be placed on a wall. The integrity of that wall is very compromised. But this is a very stable structure, how it's laid out, so it might be fine. This has that angle to it. But anyway. I should probably stop exploring and go get to work. You got anything to say? You'll find the Bracer Guild in Town Made Plaza. Allow me to wish you all the best of luck today in your academic endeavors. I look forward to seeing how things go. What exactly is there to look forward to? I wonder if he has something planned for us. But yeah, while I do, I should probably get ready because you are probably definitely going to be asked to perform some combat. And then the best thing for you... Yeah, let's do that. So you don't miss, because I know you miss a lot for some reason. Um, auto CP up and CP up. Automatic recovers in battle, recovery rate rises. If you had both of these, your CP would be ridiculous, which guys doesn't have to worry about. He's pretty pretty good when that when it comes to stuff like that. He has his own ability that takes his HP and turns it into CP. Okay, you have Shining and Airstrike. Evasion. Uh, 
And then... Yeah. And then... Sure. Sure. When in doubt, just give stat ups, I guess. I'm not sure what to do with the last one, though. Um... Yeah, why not? Okay, so, yeah, you're really slow, but that's fine. You're not supposed to be fast. Jeez, 121 speed. Rain is stacked right now. So pleased to see you yeah, you return. Don't hesitate to ask me if you need any assistance at, at all. I'll be there to support you, whatever the endeavor may be. Thank you, Chloe. Chloe. I'll appreciate your generosity. I appreciate your generosity. It's my honor. Bill must ask though, just who are these disgusting cretins you have in tow? Are you talking about my classmates? Oh, yes. Why must such filth be allowed to fester within the sight of Lady Laura's maidenly grace? Listen up, you three. Be sure to keep an appropriate distance from Lady Laura at all times, understood? Um, I'm afraid that's gonna prove a little difficult. What an irksome whelp. My apologies, she seems to be misunderstanding the situation. Okay. I th sure? You got some issues, girl. Ah. How much money do I have? I'm definitely getting everybody's thing. No, well, not everybody's, but I'm giving at least these people's things. That was basically all my money. Okay, not better. Ooh, I think that's just... Oh, it decreases the attack and everything, but that's... How much? That's 10 evasion. Wait a minute, what? I need to check something here. Okay, yeah, you have five evasion, so it adds five more. Ooh, why is my evasion lower? It used to be higher. What's going on here? And then honestly, I think I'm going to give this to Laura. And then I'm going to give myself CP Gladiator stuff. Oh, there. I passed it. Um, increase CP gains or automatically get it. Okay, this is probably better, because it just adds more. Though, if this wasn't so good, I'd definitely give you this, but... Okay, um... Keeping that... 
I'm gonna get rid of this for this. And then you, yeah, we'll keep that. Though honestly, I should be giving you the other stuff, but no, we're fine. Okay, um, before I worry about that stuff, let's do this. Oh, I won't have enough. So, Rain, yes, and Laura. I'll collect some more as I go along. We'll do Emma. And then we'll do, um, Usus. For now, you get this back, and you get this back. I don't know if there's... yeah. Might as well exchange a lot of that. I'm not really using most of this. And I'm about to get a whole bunch. I already did all that. Oh yeah, more Master Quartz to buy later. Um, anything? Yeah. Okay, Restrict KO and 200 cents. That's really good, but if I'm having to use that, I'm kind of boned already. And then this question is do I want. Do I think it's worth it to have five more evasion? To lose all that. It's only seven attack, but that's a hundred arts defense. And then this. Uh, it's not worth it for Reen. Nah, it's not worth it. Okay, I have more money now. Oh, there, what, 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 you? You've been well, I hope. Why, of course. We're all doing well here. They're perhaps, though perhaps less so on the business front. Oh, it's really, not really a big issue just that your father rejected the order to raise taxes here. Deliveries coming through on the water uh, highway have slowed down a fair bit ever since. It's clear as day that Duke Alperea wasn't too pleased by Lord Arsed's decision. I see. Please allow me to apologize in my father's actions. You have no reason to feel responsible, Eusis. Indeed, deliveries by train have come through just fine, so ultimately we're just... we're not up a creek without a paddle, at least. Okay, he says the dad is doing a bunch of other stuff. As is usual. Okay, prevents confusion, defense, nice. Not too bad. Um, all right. Hey guys, hope you liked that. If you did, please consider giving me a, a subscribe, a like, follow, all that stuff on all these places here. As you can see, I have a Twitch with Luminifus Quack where I record these and play games, all this stuff, a lot of new stuff coming out. Um, if you, and of course, yeah, you can follow me on YouTube here or a scribe, and Lumen is back here, and then you yeah, have Twitter, where you can get um, notifications and all that good stuff, um, and new things going on where I send messages and all that stuff, so please consider all that stuff.
and have a good one.